Okay, guys, today we have this thing here that I can't say the name. You know, that piece that you say, Hi Ruth, what's the weather today? And it's made by Amazon and its name is Echo Dot. And that's, I think, the second version or second generation. Uh, yes, it has some kind of headphone jack, micro USB, logo, rubber, buttons, and all that. I was asked by somebody, what's inside these things inside i i'm gonna come clean i never opened one of these but i'm assuming just probably a speaker some kind of logic board buttons and maybe a microphone or an array of microphones or something i don't really see a lot how could be a lot inside there i i'm just testing it that it works no it's not connected to the internet just you know personal choice that's uh, you do you and without further ado they used to say let's open it let's uh, have some surgery here and with my very surgical knife i will try to peel i guess that's how we start do not try this at home because you know playing with knives and all that kind of stuff is not cool all the time Let's see if this just peels like that, or does it need more professional intervention, or Jeff Bezos, how you doing? Anyway, let's uh, get this one out. Okay, so this piece is out. Feels actually pretty cool, like a quite, quite a high quality plastic. Okay, so now the plastic is gone. What is next? Looks like it's uh, torque screws inside there. Why did this not come up with the plastic? It's beyond me. And I don't understand how is this even put in there? Well, let's try to crack it open. We're here now, so I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna stop. You know, I'm not gonna stop. Here it goes. Yes, that's another piece and uh these look like uh look like tens to me i might be very extremely wrong with that number don't hold me on that and uh, let me get my very expensive toolbox and see if we have a 10. 10 is right here uh, let's see uh no actually it might be a nine okay well let's uh let's try it yes that's what it is okay let's uh try it now insert the bit here that doesn't go in and let's start uh, butchering this thing here. Or I mean, disassembling it very nicely and very gently. So I'm just gonna, gonna skip forward this part uh, because I don't have a, you know, electric screwdriver or electronic screwdriver since I live back in the 1500s and see you in a second. okay that was easier than i thought okay four quite long screws i would say and if anybody out there knows if this eco dot is second generation or first generation please correct me if i'm wrong i don't mind being corrected when i'm wrong so don't worry don't feel bad about it i feel better if you actually help me if i'm wrong and what and what is going on here i don't even understand what's i don't even understand what's inside here huh okay let's try to remove this ribbon here okay it's gone there's a piece of really high quality rubber a piece of looks like a cast piece of aluminum really nice actually i'm surprised so far i didn't expect it to be this good a separate separating bracket let me put this on the side this is the logic board here that does the controls and where is the speaker i'm assuming it should be here but it better be here because i know it works that i know so let's try to open this part up to pry it up or something okay very brutal it says mary right here well i think the speaker might be inside here looks like one of those uh phone speakers it's like enclosed on it for to get that that kind of subwoofer uh effect is there is absolutely nothing else except for this kind of thingy right here uh, looks like an rfid reader or something if you can uh, take a look at that looks like an rfid reader and here's the speaker well since we're at this point now i'm not gonna stop here let me see if this can be taken apart is I, i'm not planning to use this anyway so 
don't worry about it yes the speaker is right here and it's very tiny i'm not sure if you can see that let me put the light on here can you see the speaker there it's very tiny it's it's that is the speaker right there and that's its enclosure it's very interesting how this one was built i did not expect it to actually be built this good for that kind of speaker and uh yeah if you think Alexa is creepy that's up to you if you think it's cool that's still up to you i really have no opinion on it i myself don't use it because just my personal choice not to but other than that i think i am done for today and this was what's inside the eco dot either uh, first generation or second generation you guys decide about it okay thank you for watching and i hope you learned what you wanted to learn and subscribe like share that would be great see you next time bye Oh